I run away I think I'll go back to that place I stay Lay on the server the time shot away Hello people, it's Poet and we are back on time shot. Now, today I want to work on that outer wall thing a bit. I knew I had obsidian on me. I went down here to put obsidian in the chest and I didn't see any, but there it was. I'm going to work on that outer wall thing. I got a few donations to take care of, so I'll go ahead and do those. I think they're just iron ones. I could be wrong, actually. I should really check that. You know what? Hold on a split second. I don't have to usually get out of the game, but uh, let me let me just double check the the amount of these donations here. Doop a doop boop boop doop boop boop doop 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 doop. Typing, typing the things. Hold on, bear with me. I found it. Okay, I got it. Yep. Sure enough. Great. Okay. Back in the game. Let's go and take care of these really quick. And then that's the thing that I'm talking about that I'm going to work on. Uh, so I'll need some stone brick and maybe some stone stairs. I'll need more spruce log. I'm trying to think of all the things I might need. Maybe some slabs of some kind. Uh, oh, I got, <laughs> I got them in my inventory already. Running this way. Now these donations, like the others most commonly have been recently, are all Steam games. Nom 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 nom. Uh, oh boy. Oh boy, I didn't realize that I was actually already at the limit. Um, oops. So I gotta tear out this wall a bit. Just a little bit. I don't have to go all the way because uh, it'll sit right on there. So if I go out, what? What's this? Oh, old cave. If I go out two blocks, that should be enough. And I only have to go up to like this height. Not even really. So people have been donating Steam games quite a bit. Um, and I think I said in the video that win was in that it is a little bit overwhelming. Um, I've never really received gifts like that ever before in my life. Um, I mean, some close friends have given me gifts of video games on Steam before, um, but it's different when uh, the fans give me games like that because I think most of the time they're expecting that I'm going to be playing them which I, I'll repeat myself now that, you know, that isn't the case. Bye, Edson. Um, that isn't the case. Um, there's a chance that I'll play it, but it's not a for sure thing. Okay, so how does this go? Log there, and then... What? <laughs> I don't know how this is supposed to look. Okay, so it goes... I guess just sits on, on here. I'll have to redo these with the spruce, I guess, afterwards, which I hate doing because I always screw it up. Um, so this one is, let's do, this is another one from Leg Legend Dairy, donated again. And uh, let me just see the message here. I have it somewhere. Hold on. Aha, here it is. It says, Dear Poet, this is the most adorable rage fuel you'll ever play. Who doesn't like pugs? Hope you like it. And the game was Turbo Pug. Turbo Pug. Which, I think the game was, like, worth a dollar or something like that. Like, it was on sale for, like, less than a dollar. So, you know, uh, I said that people get the iron block in the other rooms for donating at least a dollar. It was like 99 cents on sale for like 49 cents. But you know what? Still get an iron block because it was very nice. I actually played it on my channel. And you can see it on the channel um, somewhere. <laughs> Go check that out. It, it was fun to play. It was really fun to play for a little bit. Um, it wasn't really rage worthy, I wouldn't say. You know, it was it was actually kind of kind of nice. So let's... Uh, 
Let's go like that, I guess, for now. Uh, this one is from I'm the get 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 gecko like that C K O I think and the game was the uh, Lego Star Star Wars Saga oh can't fit it Star Wars Saga complete saga but minus of course the brand new movie that came out I suppose. Um, and they had a message too. Boom. Uh, oh, wait. <laughs> I could have put it right there. I will. I will put it right there. I don't know why I expanded it this way too. Oh, I guess I had to. But this one actually gets... I'm the Gecko Star Wars uh, Complete Saga, I'll say. Yeah. And let's see if there's a message. There was a message positive of that. Uh, it says, Hey, Poet, I've been watching your videos since Red Cubed and wanted to donate, but this is the only way I could, so hope you like it, and may the Force be with you. It's a very cool message, and uh, I did say a while back that that game would be one that I play, because I asked people uh, how they liked the, the Jurassic World Lego game, and I really liked it. I really did, and I was thinking to myself, okay, I really like the Jurassic World Lego game, so I want to play more. I want to play more of those kinds of games. Uh, I need these. Anything else? Dirt. Okay. I'm looting these chests even though those chests were supposed to be for that back wall. Doesn't matter. Um, but yeah, I, I did say, I asked people what kind of Lego game they would like to see in apart from uh, the Jurassic World, and I think most people uh, tweeted back at me, or I think it was Twitter, they tweeted back at me and said um, Star Wars was definitely worth playing, and that I would really enjoy it, so I'm looking forward to that one, um, and as you guys already know, like I had just said, I did record the Turbo Pug for the channel also, which is kind of a one-off, um, it's definitely not a game you'd have a series on. I, I know that for a fact. But it was fun to play, you know? I, I gave it a shot. It was fun. I was having fun. So I felt like, you know what? It might as well work for the channel. You know, while while I'm having fun, why not spend that time recording? Um, let's see here. How am I going to do all of this? kind of actually need I kind of actually need scaffolding to be like on this side more um, I actually want to have spruce come across like this in this spot but it's kind of an issue that it's four blocks I, I really wish that this whole build would have been odd numbers um, and as I was putting these pillars up I really Regretted the fact that they weren't odd numbers like that. Um, I guess those should go down like that. I don't know. So what I felt that I would do, just to start it out, uh, and this won't be the, fi uh, the final look, the finished look. Don't worry. It's just going to be very plain right now. Um, but I want to just fill it with stone brick. And then kind of chisel it out from there. One, two, three, four, five. And then on the fifth one, I kind of want to go like, like this. I need, need blocks on my bar. So I wanted to talk about um, kind of how things are going. Uh, things have been really good um, emotionally. I just did another Japan Crate on the channel. If you haven't seen Japan Crate, I said this the last time, but like I have so much fun doing them. Opening these these Japanese crates of candy and stuff and seeing what's in them. Um, I was approached by another company called Tokyo Treat, and they saw my Japan Crate video and actually liked it so much they wanted me to do uh, one for them as well. So they sponsored me, and I will be doing 
those as well. Um, basically, sponsorship just means they're not paying me for a review or anything. Um, but they want me to feature it on my channel. And I totally will. Because, you know, it's kind of cool that we get to try these Japanese candies and stuff. And, um, be whoop! <laughs> Forgot that there was no bottom to that. Uh, because I had done one before for Japan Crate, they were impressed. They saw what I what I did, how I did it, and they sent me a new box. But well, they haven't sent it yet, but they're they're going to apparently. How should this look? I don't know. I'm just gonna kind of, like I said, fill it in, and then take a step back and and look at it here. Okay. That looks hideous. Hideous. I already know, like, I gotta fill in the sides somehow. <laughs> but I don't know how. <laughs> Maybe with, like, more spruce? Like, I don't, I don't know here. I'm just gonna try spruce on this side, and I'll maybe try... Um, stone brick on the other side. That's about all I wanted to do. Go this way. Try stone brick on this side. Owie. See how it looks if I fill it in with just stone brick here. Okay, and that's all the way to the top, basically. I need to eat. So that when I fall, I can actually heal. I think I got Feather Falling 3 on these boots right now. I do. So it only takes heart and a half, but seriously, it hurts. So there's that look. It's okay. It's that look. It's okay. I, I don't like that as much. I think that if I filled it in on the sides with spruce, more spruce, then I feel like this whole wall needs more spruce in it. You know what I mean? Like if I'm using so much spruce here, I feel like where's the spruce on the wall? You know, do I replace the coal block pattern with spruce maybe? Do I do I replace these pillars with spruce? No, that would look weird. Um, maybe the, the stone... Slabs, do I replace those with spruce? Do I put spruce bars in between? Like, there's got to be a way to implement spruce in the rest of the wall, I think. This is what I really feel. Um, bam. <laughs> Done. I don't know. This is really... This is a tough, tough one here. Like, I could go... Kind of like that, and put these, like, bars in between. Move it, chicken. How does that look? It's going to look stupid. Yeah, that looks dumb. I don't know. It's got to have spruce somehow. Let's try that other idea that I had. Uh, replacing the stone slabs. There we go. Um, so... As you guys know, I have been, uh, well, okay, here, I'll, I'll lay it on the line, that earnings for January, historically, are really low, and I've been earning less and less uh, as the months go by. I don't know why, I don't know what it is, it seems like... September, October, whatever it was, suddenly the views and everything just, like, tanked. They went from uh, easily supporting me and win. Like, I'll, I'll be honest with you guys that the last several months, um, I've been actually helping win out. She does YouTube full-time, but we kind of pool the monies we get, and and that's what it's all about, like... Uh, the rent on her house and my mortgage are both paid by me. Um, all of the food, everything that we have for clothing, entertainment, what have you, everything. 
uh, is covered by the revenue that that we get. Um, and then like you're you're so comfortable doing that kind of thing, and then it just gets harder and harder and harder. Um, not to the point where like I'm panicking or anything like that. That doesn't look too bad. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. I'm going to do it over here and over here. And let's kind of just see how it pans out. Um, not to the point where I'm panicking, but January historically is always the worst month for revenue. Um, so, like, it's at the point right now where um, I'm going to have maybe, like, I don't know, let's say $1,000 total to live on for the entire month. And I'm not sure how that's going to work, how I'm going to be able to do that. With the Did I not? Huh? Behind these leaves, did I not? Hold on a second. Oh, because this is the wide wall. Okay, I see. <laughs> I was getting confused. Like, where's the other pillar? It should be right here. But no, this is this is the wide wall. Okay, I got it. I got it. I know what I'm doing. Um, but like my my mortgage on my house is well over a thousand dollars. Just the mortgage. Um, then you got to pay property taxes, utilities. Got to pay for food. Um, I wanted to go to the dentist. <laughs> sometime this month, this next month. Um, and then there's uh, new car payments and wins rent and her food and it goes on and on and on and on and on. Internet for both houses, TV for both houses, etc. Um, so I'm really hoping that something, something happens. Like I'm going to be trying to maybe get the Patreon site up and running, and I'm hoping that someone's charitable enough to interact with that. Um, but what else can I say? I don't. I don't know. I'm not ready to start looking for work yet. <laughs> I'm definitely not. Um, not even a part-time job. I think that will be fine. So you know, don't don't freak out yet. But I can easily see, like, how fragile the YouTube environment is. That doesn't look too bad at all. Actually. Like, I don't mind that too much. I kind of wish that the wood would go, like, across to, like, hold up and be support for the wall. But that's why I tried the cross sections first. But it didn't look right. Hmm. That doesn't look bad, though. Especially with this big section being um, in spruce like it is. Now, I wanted to dig out these these sections here. So let me just pillar up again. And I wanted to like, with them. Oh, maybe I'll keep that one spruce, or up, uh, stone brick. And I'll do something like with these. Um, you know what? Maybe I'll go kind of like that. And then like that. And I could actually do the same over here. Like that. And then... To be honest, I could actually... Let's see if I can actually pull this off. Like, I don't know how this will look at all, but... I place one there, and I place one there. And there's like a hole in the middle. Nah. Nah. This is why some people like Fabe and Asia, they build entirely in creative mode first on their own world downloads and then go back to it later. I don't do that. <laughs> um, I feel like the inside of this should be like hollowed out because that's where the so where the walkway is. So these actually need to be dug out again. But those can be like that. That can stay like that. These p 
pieces could be those again. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like that should be like that. It's weird with with these pillars the way that they are, you know? This is this is a problem for me. I go like that and then like that. Okay. I'm going to try just going across and doing the same thing to all of the sides here. Um, but anyway, that's why I wanted to say, like, I appreciate the the games on Steam. You know, don't don't stop doing that, especially like I'm the Gecko said on his little note to me is that you know that's the only way that he could down uh, donate. You know, some some people get Steam gift cards and stuff for Christmas or birthdays, um, and they feel like giving something back to me, that's amazing. That's a, that's so cool. Um, but like right now, um, it, it's funny, like, if you get money in the form of like a Steam game, um, and I've made the obligation to pay 50% of that price to charity, and meanwhile I can't afford to pay for my own food, that's gonna be an issue. So, it's, I don't know, do I have to say, no, I won't donate to charity if you donate a Steam game to me? That seems unfair to me, and I hate, I hate that kind of mentality, so I don't know where I'm at, and I don't know what to do, and that's why I'm kind of, I'm begging for suggestions here. What was I coming down here for? I need, like, iron bars or something. Here we go. Um, I'm going to need more of what? Anything? Could use stone brick stairs. I have none. Good job. Okay. Let's grab this and just make him into stairs. Okay. Um so it's it's one of those things where that's why I want to get things like the Patreon page up. I want to get my Society Six shirt shop up and running, which will really help. Uh I ran into an issue today, actually, where uh, Society 6 would have probably, I hope, come in handy, I don't know. Um, but Spreadshirt pays me out um, four times a year. So only four times do I get paid from my shirt shop on Spreadshirt. And what they did this time around is they withheld uh, something like $50 from me um, for no reason that I can find. Like, I, I seriously have no idea why it was withheld but it was and it really kind of upset me it's almost like this piece of the wall needs to come down I'm gonna tear this out like that like that yeah so this still has the piece, this still has the piece. I'm actually going to tear it out to there. And this piece that I just placed I can remove. And good. So now it looks kind of the same on both sides. This is spruce, this is not spruce, but picture it to be the same. Um, I actually need to take out these as well. But anyway, they held money away from me, and I don't know why. I contacted them to try to figure out why. I I kind of think that it has to do with the taxation thing. Like, they've put in new rules uh, for taxing, and they didn't tell me about it, so they just took money from me for no reason. And that kind of thing really grinds my gears, and there's nothing much I can do about it. But, you know, it is what it is. They just did it. How are you supposed to fight that kind of a, a system? Um, it's better than receiving nothing, I suppose. But at the same time, you know, it's it's just not fair. So, let's go like this. I'll have to put, like, torches up on here because these are spawn pads now all of a sudden. So maybe if I go like that. like Actually, more like that and like that. I should cover this whole area. 
It kind of looks all right. You can get up and kind of see through the iron bar, more or less. Um, and this will kind of go through and probably probably be structured on this side somehow. Like actually, this might be spruce right here too. And then this will be spruce. And this whole thing should be spruce. So let's tear that that down. When I decided that it was going to be spruce. Whoops. Went a little bit too far. Too far. You've gone too far. There we go. And all the way up. All the way up. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah. Let's look at not bad already. Uh, how am I gonna jump? Okay, did it. My inventory is just so full. Why do I have like eggs? Uh, four carrots. I'm gonna hold on to because I want carrots. This I can throw away. I think. An almost dead luck of the C3 fishing rod. Get out! Get out of my inventory. Why is that even there? What am I going fishing? Oh, that's what I want to do finished up here too okay so I put those pieces like that but it's not not quite right like this should be like this I didn't realize just how high this went so I'm gonna have to lose these blocks I think break them away let's go all the way over. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, I talk about finances a lot. I kind of like you guys being in the loop about, you know, what's going on with the channel, how we're faring, how we're doing things. You know, I love doing what I do. I couldn't dream of doing anything else. Um, people often ask me, what would you do if it suddenly started to not pay off? Um, I think this year will be the ultimate test. You know, I'm getting married. Um, Wynn and I are engaged, obviously, um, so that's going to be an expense. I have to think about moving expenses and things like that. Um, it's all going to be kind of part of the, the cost. This will be the deciding year, and what would I do if I wasn't doing YouTube full-time? Honestly, I, I have no answer for you. I don't know. Um... I don't want to do anything else. That's all that I'll say. So, you know, because uh, here's the thing. I'm I'm not asking for donations uh, even now. I mean, if I can't support myself, then I just can't support myself. I don't want to rely on you guys to support me, even through, like, Patreon or something like that. Um, right now, it's to the point where if I had something like Patreon, everything would be fine in the world. So that's kind of what I'm, I'm. My goal is is to get that kind of working. I want to get my Society Six shirt uh, uh, shirt shop up so that we got better designs, better looking products. Um, maybe influence people to to get more stuff from those shops and stuff. And just kind of uh, go based on that. Now where did that? Did I not pick up that crafting table. Oh, I had I had it right there. There we go. Um, because right now, if I had those kinds of revenue streams, then I'd be fine. Um, I, if I was ever to the point where I wouldn't be fine even with those revenue streams, that's the problem area where I'd have to be like, okay, what, what else can I do with my life? Um, so let's, let's hope, let's cross our fingers that it doesn't get that, that bad. January is always a bad month, so, you know. Complain as I might, it's always bad. So, gotta tear those out. Let's go. Like, let's actually break that. And do we? I just want to do like. Do I just want to go like. Like this. Done. You know. Do what do I? What do I want to do here? Is that really all that I 
want to do? I don't know. This whole side here looks really weird that it's kind of like this. I feel like it needs... It needs something more somehow. I don't know how, but it just... I feel like it does. Go up like this. Okay. Mobs are going to spawn in there. I just know it. I'll have to break it open and fix that. Oh, okay. So that was the the stair you could see through it. So that's going to have to be solid there. Let's go up. This will be our last tweak. Oh, I see. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. I got it. This will be our last tweak, and then I think we're going to end the episode there. But yeah, that's... This is kind of just me being honest with you guys, talking about finances, talking about how we're doing, talking about all that kind of stuff. I don't want anybody to worry. Um, you know, we're not at a position where we have to, like, completely stop doing YouTube or anything like that. Um, this year will be the deciding factor, really. And, you know, if, if I can't make it, then I don't know who can. So I'm, I'm confident that I will be able to do it. Let's go out with I just picked up all that crap. That's what that was. Don't want it. Go away. It's looking all right. It's looking okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay. I don't like how it looks yet, but I will keep chiseling away at it. I'll keep adding maybe um, stone brick in between or slabs. Like I got slabs to go between the spots right there. Round off the top, make it look more castle-y. Um, what else? I don't know, maybe put stairs up up top there. I could use some cobble, the uh, cobble wall pieces, perhaps, inside places like there. There's a lot that I can do to chisel this away and make it look kind of cool. Um, these logs just sticking out like that, I don't like that either. So I'm probably going to opt to do, like, um, stairs, spruce stairs, or dark oak stairs. Probably more appropriate, but um, you'll do something like that. Just to kind of round it off a little bit. Yeah, I need the, the dark oak stairs. Those are too light. Um, round it off a little bit, like that. Yeah, and that'll look that'll look all right. I kind of just want to make this place look more fortified, more castly, more something. You know, I don't even know what to call this, but the entrance way I was never happy with. I'm starting to really like how this is looking. So now the back side has to be done as well. I'll have to like box this in. Yep, but it'll look pretty good. And then, do I want to do the same thing, same sort of style over here? And this is different because this is. I believe an odd number. It is, is it? Yeah, it is. Is it? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. No, it's all, it's even as well, but it's like a different width. Stair. Yeah, it's there's two blocks in the middle there. It's a different width, so I don't know if I'm gonna do anything special here. Um. That's not good either. Oops. Torches, I need them. But there we have it. Thank you guys for watching. Um, again, if you guys have any suggestions for Patreon, like what perks I could possibly give to the people who donate monthly, um, let me know. Ooh, this is going to be bad. Things are spawning up there now too. Um, <laughs> leave them in the comments those suggestions. Um, if you want to donate, the link is in the description of Time Shot videos only. Again, we are completely fine. Just wanted to be honest with you guys that January is always the worst month for YouTubers. Not just me, but for every YouTuber. Um, they pay out less. Advertisers do not like giving out revenue after the Christmas season. So I'm literally making like half of what I did last month. And last month 
uh, me and Wynn were basically scraping by. So I'm hoping that a miracle happens, but we'll see what happens. I'm going to work extra hard at getting the Patreon thing out uh, probably this week. I'm going to really gear for that and go from there. So with that, thank you again. We'll see you guys next time on Time Shot. Bye-bye. We'll